You guys know what time it is when you see a box like this. We're going to do a blind reveal here. Uh, this is coming from PSA. And this is a 17 card uh, all Pokemon uh, from the TCG special. Turnaround time was just over a month. I think it was like a month and a week extra. Um, I flipped these the wrong way, but we are starting with the uh, the very much lesser of Umbreon VMAX from Evolving Skies. Uh, got this in a PSA 10. We're gonna just uh, we're just gonna do this a different way. Instead of doing the thumb thing, we're just gonna reveal the next card. Charizard. Oh, okay. So um, I traded for this card um, for uh, a booster box. And I knew that it probably might not get a 10. It, it was a low a low chance at a 10. Um, but that's fine. I'm going to crack this, and this is going to go in my binder. So not a big deal there. We'll just make some piles here. Ooh, next up. Okay, we got the Gardevoir. Make some piles over here. Um, now, this was in SGC 10 Crackout. So very happy with that right there. Next up. Okay, we got the Reggie, the Reggie from Crown Zenith, Zenith, got a nice 10 there, okay. Let's see what card is next. Oh, okay, so this is one, I <laughs> uh, shouldn't grade this. <laughs> I thought for sure that this was a 10, without a doubt, otherwise I wouldn't have graded it. Um, I will say this, that when I have my submissions, uh, my PSA subs, and they go to New Jersey or wherever, the other place, and they don't actually get graded in California, they're always harsher every single time. So, uh, and that's where this one came from. So, um, I'm thinking that this might not be the best order. Oh, Zoroark from Crown Zenith. We got that in a 10. I think I sent two of these. Um, both had them pre-graded as a 10, so not bad there. Next up, we have... Reggie, Reggie Drago. Okay, this one hurts. I had this pre-graded a solid 10. This card looked good. That is unfortunate, but that's New Jersey coming for me. Dang. All right, next up. Ooh, we got the Dark Rye, Crown Zenith in a 10. I will take that. Not the most valuable card, some of these, but, you know, some got to hit 10s on some of them, so... Um, we do have a few more higher higher dollar cards. I don't know where they are in here, but we'll get to those. All right, after Dark Rye, we have... Oh, I had really good luck with these before. I graded quite a few of these and got 10s. I uh, don't think it, I'm going to either uh, break even or lose on this card. I uh, sold a few of them before, and a 10 did pretty good. Next up... Oh, okay, so this is a card I pulled. This is the Alakazam uh, from Paldean Fates. Yeah, I, I had this as a pre-grade as a 10. It looked minty mint, so no surprise there. All right, next up. Oh, another Zorark in a 9. That is unfortunate. Ooh, okay. Got to get back on that 10 train. All right, so we got Deoxys. Um, I've graded these before, one of these before as well. Um, had good luck with this, this card as well, so another gem mint 10 there. All right, let's see what I keep... I keep forgetting to reveal because we're doing this differently. So next card up is ooh okay, Zacian V. A lot of crown, a lot of crown zenith here. Um, it's again not the biggest card, but sells well in a ten. Definitely worth it if you get it at a good price, especially with these specials. I'll take that. Next up we have Sweek. Oh. Man, I had good luck grading the Sweekoons too. Had this one out of 10 for sure. All right, this one might have been um, like 50-50, I think, actually. Now that I'm remembering, I think I, I think I kind of had this. Could be a 9, could be a 10. So not the worst, but I think they might have been a little bit on the harsh side. Next up. Oh, no way. Oh. Damn. I had this out of 10. Great looking card. Um, oh, that sucks. Next up, oh man. Now this card is definitely not worth sending, uh, unless it is a 10. I get this from a local card shop, looked good. Thought it had a chance, even, but 
What you gonna do? Still a nice looking card though. So we're all right. Next up, I think there's only one card left. Oh man, this is puts us at. <sighs> okay, I have the other two dogs in tens, and I needed this one in a ten. So unfortunately, this is gonna push us over. This is one of my worst submissions in a while. This is what happens to me with the jersey. So we have uh, we have one more nine than ten. Mm. Well, that is unfortunate. Um, if you're interested in picking up any of these, uh, my eBay page will be linked below. I'll have ooh, not all of these, but most of these probably listed from this order. Um, dang. Yeah, I'm definitely cracking out the Charizard and keeping that. That Entei hurts. I'm gonna, I might just have to buy that outright in a 10 to have that uh, set complete because I have the other two dogs that I graded in a 10 myself. So, um, yeah, that gives us, what, nine, nine nines and eight tens. So, damn. Um, usually, I aim for 70% gem rate. I try and be really critical, but, uh, dude, that New Jersey side, they get me. Um, yeah. Well, that is going to do it for this one, guys. Uh, let me know what you guys thought of this uh, PSA reveal. Let me know if you were disappointed like me or if you were excited. Um, still fun. Still still definitely worth it. It's going to be okay. It's not like I'm going to lose money overall in this order. Just on a few cards. So um, we'll definitely make up for it there. It's not too big of a deal so um that is the risk that you take when you grade obviously uh you know i've graded quite a bit at this point now and you know it's just um sometimes you get a tough grader sometimes you get an easy grader i tend to be very overly critical of the cards myself and i have a pretty good idea of what they're going to get for the most part i think my my average gem rate i think over all my orders although this is going to bring my average down a little i'd have to crunch the numbers I think we're in the 75% range gem rate overall. So, and that's not including like, sometimes you send a card that, you know, is never going to 10. So not including those because obviously, you know, um, but that's few and far between for me. Usually I don't send, <coughs> excuse me. Usually I don't send them unless they're going to get a 10. I think I have the chance at a 10. So that's going to do it for this one, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I'll catch you in the next one. And remember, it was never a phase.